Louisville is preparing for the potential of snow next week. JCBS is making sure parents are aware of its changes to its snow day plan. Yeah, that includes far fewer cancellations and more NTI days. Jim Stratman is in the studio with us breaking that down. And Jim, luckily here, we do know that the district plans to let parents know pretty early. Yeah, they're going to do their best. By 5 o'clock day of, they're going to have a decision made, and that message is going to go out to parents through the school messenger app and also on social media. And of course, we'll let you know here on WHAS 11 as well. Now that could be late for some parents, parents, but with the new go or no go policy, JCPS is doing away with some of the flexibility it once had in favor of a more black and white kind of approach. Now students are going to have to make sure that they are prepared for any bad weather by taking home their computers, chargers and materials the day before. If it looks like we could have some bad weather coming. When students are home, they're going to be working on short term NTI lessons. The district says that these lessons are going to be self paced and the students will not get live instruction from teachers online during those NTI days. JCPS hopes this new plan will keep students engaged and learning while eliminating the need for makeup days and extending the school year. Now we did have a chance to speak with officials from the Jefferson County Teachers Association about this idea of dropping snow days. I really think that is a superintendent and school board decision. Uh, certainly, we believe that um, we should try to use the option that makes the most sense for the situation. Now, if students do have an NTI day, that means that extracurricular club activities, team practices, games, they are all going to be canceled as well. District officials told us the bitter cold temperatures coming next week could see a chance to put this plan into action very, very soon. But remember, Monday school is already closed for Martin Luther King Jr. Day. That won't be NTI. We are expected to hear more about this plan from the district a little bit later on this afternoon. Grace, Eric. Jim, thank you. I'll mention I just got the uh, high wind warning issued uh, that came from the city just now. Ben's already been talking about it, but just so you know, in case you got the same message, I'll underscore something that Jim said as well. It's about the WHS 11 free app. We'll send you those important weather updates on air and of course on that app. Uh, you can get alerts on school changes as soon as we get them.